Welcome to the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Whiteborning, and this is six times seven is more than simply 42. Every now and then you might hear someone ask, what is six times seven? And you may hear someone else answer, six times seven is 42. What is interesting is that this question can mean several different things. When someone asks, what is six times seven? What they might mean is, six times seven is equal to what number? The answer to that question is 42. Six times seven is equal to 42. And that is an important idea to learn. But they may also know that there are many other important ideas. So when someone asks, what is six times seven? They may be wondering, what does six times seven mean? And that is an important question. In this video, let's take a closer look at both of these ideas. Six times seven is equal to 42. Let's examine some ways that six, seven, and 42 are related to each other. To begin, if six times seven is equal to 42, then seven times six is also equal to 42. And since multiplication is related to division, we also know that 42 divided by six is equal to seven, and 42 divided by seven is equal to six. If we look at 42 divided by seven is equal to six, we can see that there are several different ways to write this idea. We can write 42 divided by seven is equal to six, or we can write 42 divided by seven is equal to six, and that can be very useful. So understanding six times seven is more than simply knowing that the product is 42. Here is an array. We know that an array that is seven by six will have a total of 42. And we also know that we can break 42 apart into seven groups of six, just like this. And when we put seven groups of six together, the total is 42. And we know that we can break 42 apart into six groups of seven, just like this. And when we put six groups of seven together, the total is 42. So we can think of six times seven as six groups of seven. You may recognize this as repeated addition. And if we count the groups of seven, we can see that there are one, two, three, four, five, six groups of seven. And the total of six groups of seven is 42. And if six times seven is equal to 42, we also know that seven times six is equal to 42. So we can think of 42 as seven groups of six. If we count the groups of six, we can see that there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven groups of six, which is equal to 42. Six times seven is equal to 42, and there are many more important ideas. When we look on the multiplication table, we can see that six times seven is equal to 42. 42 is a multiple of six, and 42 is also a multiple of seven. In fact, if you look closely, you'll find another connection. You'll see that 42 is the seventh multiple of six. I'll count the multiples of six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And 42 is the sixth multiple of seven. I'll count the multiples of seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Understanding that 42 is a multiple of both six and seven is very important. Six times seven is equal to 42 and there are many important ideas related to the number 42. As we think about the number 42, we know that if we divided it into seven equal parts, like this, that each part would be one seventh of 42, and one seventh of 42 is equal to six. And at the same time, if we divided 42 into six equal parts, each part would be one sixth of 42, and one sixth of 42 is equal to seven. When you examine six times seven is equal to 42, you may notice that 42 is greater than six and 42 is also greater than seven. But how many times greater? Here is the answer. 42 is seven times greater than six. And there is another connection. 42 is also six times greater than seven. As you can see, there are many relationships among these numbers. So six times seven is equal to 42, and that is an important idea. But as you can tell, it's not the end of the story. There are many more relationships, many more connections, and many more ideas waiting to be discovered as we take a closer look at multiplication. 
This is the Multiplication Course. My name is Steve Whitehorny, and this is a reminder that 6 times 7 is more than simply 42.